What up, Sierra? Huh? So I'm Frisco right now. Um, that's a place called North Beach. Uh, I guess they call it Little Italy out here. And uh, I'm about to have dinner. I'm with another TikToker named Infamous and Sean, but they're across the street having Italian food. I don't even want no Italian food. So I'm over here at this spot called Highway having uh, burgers. A chicken, no, a spicy chicken sandwich and fries, right? I tried to go sit with them across the street, but the the restaurant over there was like, oh, because your food ain't from our restaurant, you can't sit over here. So that's why I'm sitting over here by myself. But I'm finna knock these, uh, I'm finna knock these fries down though. I mean, this burger down. And still enjoy my night, you feel me? How's everybody doing though? Thank you guys for joining the live. Those of you are barely joining the live, I'm down in East, no, North Beach, in Little Italy, in San Francisco, about to have dinner. I'm about to knock down a spicy chicken sandwich. Thank you, Kang, uh, for the gifts with some fries. And uh, Sean and another uh, Vietnamese homie named Infamous. That's also a TikToker. His name is Infamous underscore 211. Uh, follow him, check him out. He's out of here. He's from here, out of the Bay Area. So he's basically taking us around, showing us around. They're across the street right now having. Hey, Juju! -ju. They're across the street right now having um, Italian food. And I'm over here having this crispy chicken sandwich. You feel me? Oh, I forgot. I got my condiments all in my pockets. It's been a pretty long day. We went to, um, I don't even know the name of the place. Some kind of tower, uh, 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 something that starts with a B, Peaks. Something, Batman Peaks or something like that, right? And then uh, we went uh, to a lighthouse. I don't even remember the name of the lighthouse. And then we went to the Golden Gate Bridge. I mobbed across the whole entire Golden Gate Bridge. And, uh, and now, oh, and then we went, we stopped, we went to Chinatown. And uh, we, um, we stopped at a, um, a fortune cookie place where they make fortune cookies. And uh, we checked it out, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And then now we're down here in uh, Little Italy. Uh, having dinner, you feel me? In North Beach in San Francisco. It's pretty lit out here, y'all. It's hella people walking around. It's hella like movement, you feel what I'm saying? Uh, this is what I missed though. When I was up there in Oregon, it was so slow. Like I was like, damn, I'm, I'm dying of boredom out here. You don't see people walking around. I mean, there's people, but it's always raining. It's always cold. And um, it, wasn't, it wasn't alive, you feel what I'm saying? So, uh, I like this. This is my kind of flavor, you know? But I throw some mayonnaise in my chicken sandwich because that's a mando. Some pickles. But for the most part, y'all, I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm just gonna be sitting here eating. So, if you guys wanna sit here and watch me eat, go right ahead. Um, if you guys don't, I understand. You feel what I'm saying? But other than that, I'm gonna be right here macking. Mac and down on this, this chicken sandwich. You feel me? Got me some ketchup. Thank you, whoever's running the, uh, the lights up on this live. I appreciate it. Um, if you can't give me, I completely understand. All I ask is that you tap the screen, run the lights up on this live. If you ain't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, I ask that you hit my face right there in the corner and uh, go hit the link that's in my bio. There's these arrows that's pointing down at my link. All you gotta do, all you gotta do is tap the link and go subscribe to my YouTube. It's very easy and it's free. Those y'all that, those y'all that think that you gotta pay to subscribe to my YouTube, no, it's free. And uh, it just takes a second. I appreciate it. Oh. 
We even got some of his barbecue sauce. You know, I gotta make it down with my chicken sandwich. Let's see what y'all talking about in this chat real quick. And then I'm gonna start eating. <laughs> you feel me? I'm hungry too, so please excuse me as, as I get my grub on. Um, how you liking the bay, Pippin? Oh, you know, Pippin. Oh, oh. No, I like it. It's chill. I mean, it's different. It's beautiful out here. I can understand why the cost of living is so expensive out here. Because everywhere you look, it's just a beautiful ass scene. You can overlook the bay, you got the Golden Gate Bridge, you got the Oakland Bay Bridge, and there's hella dope spots to go chill and go check out the whole entire um, city from an aerial, uh, like on top of a mountain type view, right? Um, the aesthetics out here is nice as hell, the architecture, the the history of the, of the city, Chinatown is dope as hell. You know what I mean? Only thing I don't like is the, the roads and the way it is. You feel me? There's one way streets and all that. I don't like that shit. About in the hills. Honestly, tell you the truth, if I came out here by myself, I wouldn't hang out. The reason why I wouldn't is because of the way the roads and how people drive out here is crazy. And y'all know. I know how to drive, but y'all know I've been gone for a long time, so driving ain't my, you know what I'm saying, my strongest car, you feel me? Even though I've been traveling and I'm on the road and I stay driving, I'm keeping it real, it still ain't my strongest car. I, I I get anxiety and shit when I drive, you know what I mean? So, the way they drive out here, oh no, I wouldn't last, I wouldn't last. So I probably come through, probably get something to eat, maybe check one or two things out and keep it pushing. But, uh. I don't know why I have bad luck with burgers, yo. Every time I try to eat a burger, it always falls apart on me or, or starts breaking up on me, dog. Come on, burger. It's like a big though, huh? Hey, can y'all take a selfie? Someone take a selfie of this for me? I'm trying to like document all the food that I eat on my journey. And so um, I wasn't able to take a selfie right now. Y'all got it? You got it? Let me know you got it. Uh, so yeah, I'm lucky, I'm very fortunate that Sean took me out here. And she's been out here and she knows a lot of cool spots. Oh, and I also got guacamole in my, in my chicken, spicy chicken sandwich. Don't play with me. I already know. This shit fire though, I ain't gonna lie. This place is called Highway. In Little Italy, North Beach. I give it a 2, 1222 seal of approval. I mean, dinner, Sierra. Um, you are beautiful. Thank you. I'll take that. I'm beautiful because I look just like my mama. <laughs> so thank you. But, um, I don't know what to say about this burger falling apart on me. But every time I eat a freaking burger, this is what happens. Maybe because I'm just hella strong. <laughs> Maybe because I got like, hey Vanessa, thank you for the gift. I'm out here in the bay, but your ass, I don't know what's going on with you, girl. You talking about you sick and this and that. I don't know how long I'll be out here in the bay. Keep playing, keep playing with around with the game, girl. Oh, we're gonna thank you for the go. <laughs> Keep playing around again. You could have been right here eating dinner with me, watching me smack this burger down like a okay. real man. You know what I'm saying? No. Okay. You want to sit at home talking about you sick? Mm -hmm. 
They have the best pizza. I don't think they sell pizza here, fam. Um, Danny, what's up, Shadow? How you doing, fam? Hope you've been good. We need a battle again one day. I think I'm ready. I think my team is ready. I think my army is ready to go against yours. You feel me? Holla at me, Shadow. Let's set up a battle day. Thank you for the heart hand, Vanessa. I appreciate you. Yeah, you want to gift me and all that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do a chat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why don't you come down here and give me with your presence? You feel what I'm saying? Um, Shadow, they set up a battle day. I think I'm ready for you this time. My team is ready to whoop ass. You feel me? <laughs> Holla at me though. We're gonna set up a battle day. Being your best, your best team too. Hey, Sandy. What's up, Julian? You see your uncle getting his girl bone, baby? I ain't playing. This, this making you hungry? Baby, nephew, is it making you hungry watching uncle eat? If you, if you get hungry, you tell, you go tell mommy and uncle say, go get you some food. Get you whatever you want. <laughs> Julian, if you're hungry right now, go tell mommy that uncle said to get you whatever you want. McDonald's, chicken nugget, whatever you want. All right, tell her, tell her, tell her, baby. What? I'm on Columbus, ma. Yeah, let me show you. Do you know what area this is, Vanessa? It's Columbus, Little Italy, North Beach. And I'm eating a burger at um, at High Guy. Do you know where this is? I'm on I'm on Columbus Street. That's what it says right there. And um, North Beach, Little Italy. And I'm sitting in front of High Guy. Macking down this um, spicy chicken sandwich. Like a hardcore macho man. <laughs> you feel me? Jeff Freezy said Court Tower. We went we went by Court Tower already. Bro, live in the moment. Oh yeah, you better believe. I'm gonna live in the moment. Shoot. I'm doing every minute of this. I don't care. Can nobody do nothing, say nothing to get me out of my happy bubble? <laughs> I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stay right here where I'm at, and I'm gonna enjoy this spicy chicken sandwich. And I highly recommend it. Um, I ate sp spicy chicken sandwiches before, like from McDonald's and stuff like that. But um, this one right here is. Um, this one right here is something different. You know what I'm saying? I can't explain it, but um, like I always tell you guys, do something you never done, see something you never seen, and eat something you never ate. Try to do those three things every day. If you could capture and accomplish those things, three, three things every day, I promise you, your life will be better. Do something you never done, see something you never seen, eat something you never ate. I'm doing something I never done right now. I am seeing a whole lot of stuff I never seen and I'm eating something I ain't never ate. So instead of doing the same old repetitious meals that you always do, eating the same old stuff over and over, oh, I want to get a burger, I'm going to McDonald's. Oh, I want a burger, I'm going to Jack Box. Man, go get a burger, yeah, but go get it from a different place that you ain't never had one before. Live, I mean, if you got to drive a little ways out, oh well, 
you just went and did something you ain't never done. And on your way out there, you're probably gonna see something you ain't never seen. And then when you go eat the burger, you ate something you ain't never ate. Keep on doing that every day. And your, and your stomach. Well, well thank you. <laughs> Daddy said, I wish I was there. Well, I wish we're here too, mama. I wish all of y'all were here with me. Okay? We just mop deep through the streets. <laughs> and make dope ass content. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just have fun, you know? Live life. This is hella dope right now. Like, the atmosphere, the vibe, the scenery. I think y'all would like it out here. I highly recommend it. If you ain't ever been to um, Frisco, come to Frisco. I go Vanessa again. Oh, are you so close? I am, um, when are you, when are you leaving? Probably after we get done eating this dinner. But we can, no, we're not gonna leave. Um, I'm not gonna leave the bay. Uh, we're gonna spend the night here again. And we're gonna be here tomorrow too as well. You're a big sea guy. <laughs> no small town. Yeah. Huh? Oh, you have 30 minutes away? And you come through? Right now? Then I'll still be here in 30 minutes? Hell yeah. Feel me? Maybe if maybe she took off already. <laughs> maybe she's gonna a, a pop up out of nowhere and just hop in my life. Hey! It's me, Vanessa! Oh my god! <laughs> That'd be dope to meet you in, in person. I met a gang of my uh, friends I met through TikTok in real life and uh i will always treasure those moments you know what i mean how many other tiktokers could say that they actually met up with people that rock with them i could um i ain't just me one or two i met a lot of y'all so if vanessa comes through that'd be another blessing another another um opportunity to meet somebody Besides talking through this chat, um, et cetera, et cetera, through this app, we actually meet and kick it real life. You know what I'm saying? That's dope, right? So if any of y'all in the Bay Area, Ming, I was supposed to meet up with Ming. I don't know what's happening with Ming. Ming, uh, Ming, uh, um, let me see, did she message me? Nope. I don't know what happened with Ming. She said earlier, yeah, we can meet up. Woo, woo, woo. And then, uh, I messaged her, let her know where I was gonna be at, and she ain't hollered back since. But that's all good though. If it's meant for us to meet in person, then we'll meet. If it's not, then we won't. But if we do, you better believe it's gonna be good. You feel me? Sir, so, yesterday we were at the Santa Cruz Beach Bowl Walk. My agent, my live agent came down, hung out with us. Me and my family, my cousins from Stockton came down. They drove two hours down to Santa Cruz. Come hang out. My cousins, my nephew, um, my niece, um, my in-laws, family. And then, um, I love that background noise. <laughs> this is how I know I'm back in, back in my element. Yeah. Yes, yes. Play that funky music, my boy. <laughs> I like that. Now, um, Green Green Garden Mall came through and hung up uh, for a little bit. She blessed me with some trees, some of that devil lettuce. Good looking out. Um, my agent blessed me with a tripod and some drink. Good looking out. And um, 
Sean was with me. We had a good time. We uh, went down to Fisherman's Wharf and we um, ate there. I had some clam chowder, some raw oysters, some fries, and we also um, sung happy birthday and um, blew out uh, Sosa's, Sosa's candle on his cake. Shout out to BBG for uh, hooking up Sosa's cake for me. I really appreciate it. So, uh, one of my friends here on TikTok is the one that made Sosa's cake. Feel me? So I got none but a community full of people that are hella dope. I got hella good hearts. And uh, I appreciate all the love and all the support, you feel me? Like, I feel the love, feel me? I don't ever question it. Let me wipe my hands. I know I'm looking real beastly right now. You feel me? But food, food, food should be like an adventure. You feel me? People put too much like emphasis on eating properly and just man, fuck all that. I'm chilling. I'm living my best life. If I want to eat all crazy, well, oh well. <laughs> Who's gonna tell me not? Who's gonna tell me what I can and can't do? I did it myself. Can you me? Let's see what's cracking with this live real quick. What area are you gonna be in next weekend? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know um, day to day uh, what's gonna come or what I'm gonna do. I'm just, I just know I'm down here chilling with Sean and um, she wants to take me around to all these different dope spots. Uh, uh, wherever she, whatever she she recommends, I'm gonna go. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's one thing to do stuff on your own for the first time. It's one thing to go with someone who already experienced it. That's way better like that for me. They already know what it is. They already know what to expect. Let's go. That's one thing about life on the road when I travel. A lot of times I go through a town, a city, whatever. Now, I honestly don't think that I get a lot out of each place that I go to because I don't know the I don't know the area and of course you could Google it whatever but I don't really be like tripping on like that I just be looking around I see something I go, I'll go check it out if I don't I keep it pushing but as a result of that I missed out on a lot of cool spots because I just kept it pushing and then later on I found out like damn I was right by a dope ass spot I couldn't went to check out so I'd rather go around somewhere with people who've already done it already and they may know what it's like. That way, you don't waste a lot of time. And if they say it's good, you trust their judgment, then it's good. You feel me? Put up, Cali Chris. <laughs> Sierra said, I can't pay too much attention to what you're eating. I'm watching your back. I gotcha. You feel me? Thank you, Sierra. Sierra was watching my back. Maybe when I was at home in Oregon, every time the dog would bark, she would be like, hey, I'm <laughs> saying there's a dog barking. She always had my back. I appreciate you, fam. Small towns have always been a no for me. Man. I love Uncle. I love you too, too, too. We had fun yesterday, huh, Juju? Yesterday I rode three rides with my little nephew. Boy, 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 boy. When I post a video of my day at Santa Cruz, y'all will see because I got one video where um um I rode a ride. I don't even know what that sucker called, but it's like a ride you go up and it drop your ass. And I had my phone in my hand recording, and I ain't gonna lie, I was screaming. <laughs> I was screaming on the top of my lungs. That, that thing was scary, right? But my little nephew, he only eight years old. I'm a grown ass man. I'm five times his age, right? And um, he held it together like a champ. He was just, ooh. He, he never let out a scream like, ah! He would just go, ooh! Me? Shit. I was like, ah! <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. And the, and, the, and the cold part about it, this is the cold part about it. I didn't even want to scream. <laughs> I, I kept on telling myself, stop screaming, fool. But it would just come out of me. I never felt nothing like that in my life. It was like the boogeyman had me or something. Like, 
Like I kept telling myself, hold it together. You ain't you ain't looking good right now. Like, <laughs> I kept telling myself, it's not looking too good for the home team right now, bro. Hold it together. But uh, when the ride would go up and do some crazy, cause we were on one ride, it was flipping upside down on that. I couldn't help it. Them screams just coming. I don't know where those screams came from. <laughs> If I if I ever slide through um Long Poke, most likely I will. I got a cousin out there that I wanna see. We're gonna link up Cali Fish for sure. Um Yeah, San Diego does have a little Italy. If I was in the hospital in San Francisco, I'd go find you and hate you around, man. Unfortunately I'm down right now. Damn. Yeah, Freezy. I'm sorry to hear that, fam. I'm gonna lift you up in my prayers tonight. I lift everybody in my community up in my prayers every night. So don't trip, I got you. Um, I pray that you can, God's healing hands will be upon those doctors, you know what I mean? And they'll work a miracle or whatever they need to do to take care of you. Whatever you're gonna be in next weekend. Honestly, Cali Chris, I don't know, fam. We, put, we, we got plans for Disneyland, Death Valley, um, San Jose. Um, Maybe Magic Mountain, some lake, some mountains. We uh, we're gonna be doing a lot, and um, um, I don't know exactly what lies ahead or where I'm gonna go next or whatever. I just go with the flow. You feel me? So all I know right now is that uh, is uh, um, give you a, a a good solid answer. I have no idea what I'm gonna do next week. Tell you the truth, I don't even know what today is. <laughs> so how the hell am I supposed to know what the, what the weekend is? I don't even know what day it is right now. Tell you the truth. So I still believe next weekend I'll still be right here, up here. Uh, I'll still be with Sean in uh, in uh, California in Porterville, and then uh, um, we'll still be running around, traveling, experiencing stuff. Huh? Nah, man, I need a floss pick. Um, you got to keep the paper around the bottom. That's probably why my burgers always fall apart. Because I never do that. Thank you. And I'm like, damn, since I've been out, I've been thinking to myself like, damn, bro. I don't remember before before you, before you started doing time and all that. I don't ever remember the burgers just be falling apart on you like that. Since I've been out, every time I eat a burger, nine times out of ten, them suckers be coming out from the bottom. Hey, all the time. Thank you, Miller Gross. Here, let me read this chat, y'all. That burger is bomb. It was. It's a spicy chicken burger. I love you too, nephew. Thank you, Patrick, for the roses. I appreciate you, fam. And uh, thank you to whoever's been tapping the screen and running likes upon this live. We have 14,000 likes right now. Let's get the sucker to 20,000. You feel me? Um, Vanessa, now let me know. I have a cold. But I'm getting better. Excuses, excuses, excuses. <sighs> excuses, excuses, excuses. Okay, um, when you get better, if I'm still around, maybe we can link up. Or when you stop acting all scary. <laughs> when you stop acting all shy and shit. You feel me? We can link up. Where am I going after this? I don't know. Tell you the truth, um, I'm with I'm with Infamous. He's a, a Vietnamese homie out here from the Bay Area, and Sean. And uh, so wherever they wherever they want to go, or wherever Infamous wants to take us around to, that's where that's where we're gonna go. Uh, it's good to have someone that knows the area. You feel me? So I have no idea where we're gonna go. I think maybe we're gonna slide through Chinatown. I'm not sure though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what does it matter? What does it matter anyways? Vanessa, you at home. You got a cold. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Do you got any suggestions or something? <laughs> Feel me? Um, there you go, dancing. So you know it's good. <laughs> Thank you, Sierra. Vanessa laughing. Julian's laughing. I'm going to message you. Let me know where you're going to be in an hour. Okay, we'll see. What, what time is it right now? Almost 8 o'clock. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see if you can bring your ass out 
when your sick ass out in your sweatpants, your hair tied up in a bun, you know what I'm saying? Snotty nose, stuffy nose, you know what I'm saying? With your hoodie on. <laughs> And your slice. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see if you're really gonna roll out like that right now to come see me. You feel me? Um Hi Danny, how are you? I'm 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 good. I'm I'm good. I'm in uh North Beach, Little Italy, San Francisco. Feel me? <laughs> well, that's, uh, I'm on the other side of Dumberton? Dumberton Bridge. So it'll take me a minute. I have no idea where that bridge is, fam. Um, we out here, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know how long I'm gonna be here or where I'm gonna be next, but if you wanna link up, um, I ain't hard to find, you feel me? I'll, I'll let you know where, where, where we go after after this and then you wanna slide through, that'd be dope, you feel me? Um, other than Infamous, um, I haven't met any other of my friends from the TikTok community out here. I was supposed to main BS and, and there's a possibility that we, we could link up and hang out. But so far, the uh, people from the Bay, they be bushing. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it real. So it won't surprise me if you 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 uh, you end up you be like, oh, I could make it. You know what I'm saying or whatever. Love and grace. You so handsome. Oh, thank you. I got it from my nephew. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, I got it from my little nephew, Juju, because he handsome as hell. Woo. Uh, I think that's why I feel so uh, close to him, because um, he's the baby of his family, and I'm also the baby of my family. And uh, not to boast or brag or be conceited or anything like that, because, hey, I'm convinced. <laughs> but we both... We both some pretty fly guys though, I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? And um Yeah, I got my hamster nips from him. You know what I mean? We got them good jeans. Hey nephew, you feel me? Hey my nephew he's eight years old right now. But when he when he gets to dating age, OMG, y'all better woo! Y'all better lock up your daughters. Every time one of your daughters walk past my nephew, they gonna be breaking their neck. You feel me? Uh he gonna kill the game, I'm telling you. Ooh. 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 I'm telling you, my nephew is a pretty boy. You feel me? Um, I am that type of friend. I got your back. Julian said, okay. <laughs> Tell your mom, Julian, that you hungry. And uncle said, give you whatever you want, baby. Sandy said, try anything once and twice if you like it. Hell yeah. This chicken sandwich, the spicy chicken sandwich? I'm gonna keep it a book. I would eat it again. That's something that I would, uh, uh, yeah, I would mac it down again, for sure. That shit good, I ain't gonna lie, it's different. It's a chicken sandwich on a whole nother level. I can't explain it, it's not like no McDonald's chicken sandwich, you feel me? Jeannie, I'm in Frisco. Hey Bianca, uh, what's up Donnie? I'm in Frisco, fam. Um, I love your personality, Danny. Thank you, Cinderella. I appreciate the love. Come to Modesto. I don't know where Modesto. Are the people friendly there? I don't know. Tell you the truth, they don't talk to you. Nobody, nobody has said hi or hello. When I was in Oregon, yeah, they're hella friendly out there. They're so friendly. I was telling um, Infamous earlier. I said, man, them people are so friendly out there. I was thinking like, are these motherfuckers serial killers? You know what I'm saying? I was out there in Oregon, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Dude walk up like, hey, how you doing? Have a nice day. I was like, are you? In my head, I was like, is this dude a serial killer? Is this dude trying to snatch me up? I was saying, this dude's too friendly. You know what I'm saying? But out here, this is what I like too, because in the hood or whatever, in the um, marginalized communities or whatever, it's like, people mind their own business, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, um, and for the most part, they just going through whatever the hell they're going through. They ain't got time to say hi to nobody, really. And it's cool like that, though, because everybody's just doing their own thing. Uh, for a person like me with social anxiety or like PTSD and shit like that, when I was in Oregon, too many people were saying hi to me. I didn't feel good. I felt weird. You know what I'm saying? Like, stop saying, like, damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, 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 was, it wasn't normal. I wasn't used to that shit. Donnie, thank you. Tap, 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 tap. Um, Vanessa's hit my line. 
and I'm gonna head out that way soon. Okay, we'll see. But nah, I hope you do, Vanessa. Uh, it would it would be dope to link up and hang out. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm out here. I don't know how long I'm gonna be out here, but while I'm out here, I would really like to meet up with my friends that I met here on this TikTok app. Why? Because I want to be the one that um, basically shows and proves that uh, you do not necessarily just have to be friends through an app or through a screen or through a chat. You feel me? You can also be friends in real life. And uh, I'm trying to create my own lane and do my own thing and um, be the face of this lane. You feel me? I'm the traveling TikToker. I'm the one that actually goes out and meets up with his, uh, his friends. I don't even call y'all followers. I call y'all my friends. To call y'all my followers would be like we in a cult or something. You feel me? But uh, I'm the only one that I know of that goes out and meet up with his friends that he met on TikTok. And if there is somebody else, well, let's battle them because so far I got like, I met hella y'all, more than at least 10, you know what I'm saying, or more. So uh, if anybody else is out there meeting up with their uh, TikTok friends or whatever, I bet you I'll, 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 I'll run the numbers up on you quick. If Vanessa comes through tonight, I'll probably be at 10. Let's see, y'all. Let's see, chat, and Vanessa Bush it. <laughs> she said in about an hour. Okie dokie. So, if she does slide through in about an hour, wherever I'm at, then I'll go live again. You feel me? But we'll see. And, and she wants to be in the live, of course. You always got to respect um, um, people's uh, privacy or whatever if they want to be in the live or not. You know what I'm saying? Um, be safe, boss. There's a lot of weirdos out there. I mean, no one, fam. There's, 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 they're everywhere. So that doesn't phase me, bro. Shit, I feel comfortable out here. I want to tell you too. You put me in the suburbs, I feel hella uncomfortable. Hey, from the store. At least the food's better. Hell yeah. Nice. I got some treats for you to come to Michigan. I will, fam. I'll, I'll slide to Michigan for sure. What's good, up? What's good, bro? What up, bro? Yup. Still in Santa Cruz, bro? Nah, I left, fam. Uh, I'm, in, I'm in Frisco now. Wherever the wind blows. Yeah, that's where I go. Same people be like, where's your home? The whole world is my home. You feel what I'm saying? Wherever I lay my head, that's my home. Like the Temptation song. My papa was a rolling stone. You feel me? Wherever he lays head was his home. You feel me? And that's what I am. I'm a rolling stone. <laughs> I'm a rolling stone, baby. Let's see. I see her laughing. Um, how much time did you do? I just got done doing 14 years. But all together, in totality, throughout my whole entire life, I've done a total of over 27 and a half years. What are you going to do for Halloween tomorrow? Honestly, I don't know. I thought about dressing up. I thought about because I never dressed up for Halloween. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I never. I celebrated Hall Halloween once when I was a kid, and um, I didn't dress up though. We just wear wore whatever clothes we had on. Like give us some candy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, but I never had a costume. I never celebrated Halloween like that. I was locked up all my life. I remember going trick or treating once as a kid. That's it. And so I thought about it. I said, bro. Why don't you dress up for Halloween this year? You know what I mean? But if I'm out here, maybe not. I don't know. If we're not going to be doing anything. And we're just going to go sightseeing with hell. I look like walking around with a costume on. You know what I'm saying? But we'll see. Um, I think we might go to Alcatraz tomorrow. I'm not positive. So, you know, you got to dress for the occasion, you know? Lorna. Hi, Danny. Shout out to Sean for her generous hospitality towards you. Hell yeah. Shout out to Sean for real. Sean's hella dope. You feel me? Um, change has come laughing Gloria thank you for the black cat I appreciate you fam Lisa said I don't like heights Shit. me either when I first saw those amusement thank you Lydia for the rose when I saw those rides at the um, Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk they don't look that high when you're on the ground they're like whatever come on I know they look like whatever right but once you get on them suckers them suckers are high you know what I'm saying? Like, you're all the way up there. Like, people start looking like this little, itty bitty on the ground. I'm like, man, 
please don't malfunction. That's all I was tripping on. I was tripping on the, the, the machine malfunction. I like, please don't malfunction. Please don't break break on me. Please, this thing that got me secure to this thing, please don't pop out. You know what I'm saying? That's all I was thinking. Um, Sandy said, you love your energy. Your energy is so great. Thank you, Sandy. I'm not even at 100% right now. I'm low-key kind of tired. You know what I mean? How, you know how much I walked today? I spent an hour this morning walking around this harbor, right? And then I walked the whole entire Golden Gate Bridge, 3.4 miles. Don't play with me right now. No, not play with me. I probably walked like five miles today, yo. Like, I'm like, I'm like really on some healthy shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm on some 10,000 steps a day type shit. I'm athletic than a motherfucker. You feel me? Yeah. Um, yeah, he's getting all kinds of love here in NorCal, the Yay area. Hi. Thank you, sleeping for the rose. I appreciate you. Uh, what are? Oh, no. shout out to. Okay, uh, who's we? What do you mean by who's we? I don't get it. Patrick says San Jose, my hometown. I miss it so much. I feel you. I miss my hometown too. Monday, Halloween. Oh, Monday's Halloween. I don't even know what the hell today is. Oh, you in port. What the hell is port? I love watching you and your positivity. Thank you, Deborah. I appreciate you. Uh, I appreciate everybody that be rocking with me. I got a lot of people that rock with me. A lot of people that look forward to my lives. I got a lot of people that call me their favorite TikToker. I can't wrap my mind around that stuff sometimes. Thank you, Sleepy, for the finger heart. Um, I got people that made me a part of their daily routine. Um, lately, I've been going live several times, but before I used to go live in the morning and at night every day. And when I was doing that, uh, people would watch my lives in the morning and at night. Thank you, Stormy Whispers for the roses. And uh, one time, well, several times, I didn't go live at night, and people got at me. They said, hey, yo, like, you've become so much a part of my daily routine. What's going on? I got off work. I took a shower. I ate dinner. I'm laid up in bed waiting for your ass to go live. Like, where you at? <laughs> So, I appreciate y'all. I appreciate the love. You feel me? Um, I don't know what to say other than um, God is good. And it's, it's it's been a long way coming. You feel me? And that's all I know to say. I don't know what else to say. You know what I mean? But I appreciate you guys. It, 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 it's humbling and it gives my heart a lot of um, joy knowing that um, that I've become so much of a, a, a lot of y'all lives. You know what I'm saying? Um, you waited for me. What? Hello from Austin, Texas. Hello, Austin, Texas. Lady Faith White, you waited for me. Hello, just playing. Oh, okay. Uh, I had no idea what you're talking about. Sold out. Aloha, aloha, sold up. Um, what's up? Glad to see you enjoy your life. Much love. Thank you, Wicked Tuna. I appreciate you. Debbie, Deborah said your smile is so infectious. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Why are you trying to make me smile now? Feel me? Um, uh, how you know I'm shy? <laughs> what the hell is going on in this chat? Okay, I don't know what y'all talking about, but but uh, tranquilo. <laughs> Thank you for the hand heart. I appreciate you. Vanessa said I'm gonna come through. I swear. Okay, I'm gonna let you know where. See, right now I'm with Infamous and Sean, and Infamous is from the Bay. So he's gonna take us wherever uh, he wants to take us. It's 810. And wherever he goes, that's where we're gonna roll. I do not necessarily know exactly where, but I'm gonna let you know ASAP, ASAP Rocky, right? And then uh, and then uh, I hope you come through. That would be dope, you feel me? Uh, can't wait till you come to Texas, Danny. I'll be there one day. I'll roll up and say, howdy. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> Sierra is laughing. Lady Faith is laughing. You already know I'm gonna come through with my, <laughs> my sweats. <laughs> I already know. I already know. With your hair all up in the bun, with your slides on. You feel me? I already know. I already know what time it is. You feel me? Um, Sierra said, "Hey, Sierra, what time is it?" Um, hello from Austin. To I did not already read that. I don't know if that's true. Shout out to Sean. You are awesome, girl. You rolling with security, bro. I seen you in Santa Cruz yesterday. No, you didn't. Did you? Elena, Elena Acasta. Why didn't you come through and say what's up? You were shy or something? You could have just came up and said, hey, hi, hello. And I would be like, oh, 
OMG, hi, nice to meet you. Then we're gonna take a flick or whatever, make a quick video. Hey, I met one of my friends from TikTok. But no, you wanna act all shy. Now you wanna talk to me in the chat? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You're gonna talk to me in real life, but you rather talk to me behind the screen. Come on, girl. What type of world we living in? Um, sending air hugs to Sean for spreading your love to my Aunt Danny. Thank you, Sandy. Come, come on, Em. Um, Lindsay said, you're so fine. <laughs> what the? I got it from my nephew. I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all need to follow my nephew. Julian. J-U-L-I-E-N. Alvarado. All together. A-L-V-A-R-A-D-O. With a zero on the end. Julian Alvarado. And you'll see. My little nephew. Woo! I got all this. All of this from my nephew. You feel me? Um... Um, nephew came into my life one day. I gave him some props. Hey, that's what's up, Donnie. Thank you. Thank you for uh, loving on my nephew as well. Miller Girl said, You ain't lying. Miller Girls, I know you know how to spell, girl. Don't play with me right now. Why are you spelling everything all, all wrong? <laughs> okay, you ain't lying. Juju is a cutie. He gonna be breaking them hearts most definitely. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. But I'm gonna tell them to stay away from, from females that don't know how to spell. <laughs> I'm like, Juju, if they don't know how to spell lying, don't, no, 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 no. Don't give them no play, baby. No, I didn't. Um, no, I didn't. He was on live doing his thing. Ah, uh, Elena. Por favor, Elena. Why, 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 why? What are those? Ishlocks? Oh no, there, it's a wig. I got a wig on my head. The hell? Why would you even call that? Call it that? Are you racial or something? Um, teach him Boston Garden stuff at school. Uh, where are you at? I'm in Frisco right now. Um, North Beach, Little Italy. Good night, beautiful man. Thank you. See you when you're coming back to Santa Cruz. <laughs> Linda. Girl, you saw me at the boardwalk and you didn't even come holler. Now you want to see OMG. Sending you hugs and aloha. Likewise, sold out. I appreciate you, fam. Welcome to the Bay. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Nah, the Bay Area ain't friendly nowadays. Speaking for someone who stay in Oakland. Uh, Cali peeps are friendly like people in the Midwest. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why you guys want to say that about the city, about the town. Why you guys want to put that label on the Bay. Like you guys are proud of the fact that people out here might not be friendly. I don't care. No matter where you're at, there's good people and there's bad people. You feel me? And if you keep on saying stuff like that, talking about the Bay ain't friendly and this and that, you're gonna keep that stereotype on the, on the town. And you're gonna keep people standing on the outside of it and never knowing what's inside of it. You feel me? And they're, they're not gonna expose themselves to this because they're out of fear. Now the community is suffering. You know what I mean? And the reason why the community is suffering because of that. It's been tainted by the stereotype that nothing is good out here but bad. You feel what I'm saying? And as a result, that's why there's no money in the community. Now, if we could break that barrier and then we could get people from the outside communities to come in here to spend their money, we could do something to enrich the community and maybe change things. The reason why it's suffering is because people like you that be saying stuff like that and actually feeling proud about it. That ain't. That ain't a flex, my boy. That ain't a flex at all. You feel me? It's beautiful out here in the Bay. You feel me? I'm out here vibing. It's good energy out here. Come out here. You feel me? Come spend your money in this community. You feel me? Like, don't, don't, don't tear your community down, fam. Because if you tear your community down, what about the future generations? They're going to suffer too. You feel what I'm saying? If you don't have nothing good to say, don't say it at all. Just leave it at that. You feel me? But don't be out here trying to taint the town. Don't be out here trying to make it look bad. Because there's good people out here as well. There's hella good people out here. I'm posted right now. I ain't got no problems. I ain't got no issues. I'm chilling. Right? So many more people could come out here and do the same thing. <sighs> I'm going to leave that alone. That, 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 that right there really, that really, really rubs me the wrong way. Like, why do you think we, we live in these marginalized communities? And why do you think our communities are suffering the, the way that they are? We're a big part of that, you know what I'm saying? Because of the stuff that we say, the stuff that we do, the stuff that we so-called become proud of. Nah, bro. Something has to change, you know what I mean? And it starts with us, feel me? 
Love you too, Choo Choo. You're my baby. I swear to God, I love you, boy. I should have said hi yesterday, my bad. Juju, you see that, Juju? We got Elena in the chat right here, Juju. And when we was down there at the beach, you know what I'm saying? Doing our thing, looking sexy as hell, right, Juju? In the water, dipping and diving. She didn't even want to roll up and say hi. She didn't even want to roll up and say hello. You feel me? I don't know what the world is coming to. Is everybody like hella shy to talk in, in, in person and 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 all about um, talking through the phone nowadays or what? Because I've been gone. If that's how it is, you could at least text me or something. <laughs> or you could have sent somebody my way and would have been like, hey, yo, Elena, one of your friends from TikTok is here, but she's too shy to meet you. So could she get your number and, and maybe FaceTime you from that side of the boardwalk? You feel me? Or something. Jeez, Luis. Can't wait till you get to Flow Rider. Hey, one day. Sandy said, "And you catch people attention. Thank you, M. Um, it's a good thing. Come on, M. You come to Hawaii. One day, I will be there. Aloha. How long are you gonna be out here? I don't know, fam. I don't know. I don't. I don't live my life as far as like in a in a in a box. You feel me? I'm a free spirit. I'm a nomad. I go with the flow and whatever, whatever." happens the next minute happens the next minute i try not to stay in a box i try not to uh, box myself in you feel me so i don't know i honestly don't know and i live life knowing that tomorrow's not promised anyway so i'm just in a present moment i'm not tripping on tomorrow right now to tell you the truth i'm just chilling <laughs> so i don't know i can't you guys asking me questions that i don't have answers to um vanessa go link up uh Nah, I got faith and that's a to pull up. <laughs> Miller Gross, four for four. Can you please spell correctly? It's G O N N A. Ghana. Ghana pull up. Not Ghana. You feel me? Come on, girl. Jeez Louise. <laughs> Vanessa said, she said, just watch with an exclamation mark. Okay, I don't want no problem with you, girl. What's good? Where you at? Frisco. Bay area, how's your auntie? My auntie's good. I talked to her this morning. Uh, she's chill she's chilling. She's in Florida right now. Um, she's gonna come back in December to be with my family in Stockton. So uh, maybe, hopefully, if all goes well, I'll be there too, and uh, I get to um, go on morning walks again. With okay, number one, you feel me? But she's good though. Uh, we chopped it up this morning. We Facetime. I'm in Frisco, fam. Danny, listen, I was thinking the same thing. I was thinking the same, this, just be careful. Can y'all please stop saying that in my chat, yo? Stop telling me to be careful. I know that you guys care and you guys have good intentions, right? But please stop trying to make the community look bad, like it's a dangerous place. There's good people everywhere and there's bad people everywhere. I don't care if you live in a gated community, in the suburbs, if, you're, if you got a mansion and your neighbor got some mansion, it don't matter. There's good and bad people everywhere in every part of this earth. You feel me? So stop automatically making this place just a bad place. That's not possible. Am I a good person? I'm not an angel, but I'm just saying, am I a good person? Okay. So if I'm a good person, then there's good people out here then, right? Sheesh. You just got to get to know the people. A lot of you guys judge from the outside. You guys don't step foot into the community. You guys don't rub elbows with the people. If you do, you will come to see that they're human beings just like you. They breathe blood, they breathe, they eat, they piss, they poop just like you. They ain't no different than you. They have feelings just like you. They have dreams just like you. They got families just like you. They matter to somebody just like you. They're somebody's brother, uncle, dad, nephew, niece, aunt, grandma. You know what I'm saying? So stop making it to where you dehumanize people and you stop looking at them like fellow human beings they're your fellow human beings just because what they live in the bay or whatever all of a sudden they're all bad that's that's ignorance bro straight up i'm gonna stop talking i need to keep my moosa <laughs> i need to keep my moosa because y'all got me Ooh, ooh. i feel like you're straying far away from me now Arizona was right around the corner. Damn, Lydia! <laughs> I didn't even leave Cali yet. What's going on here? Um, 27 point, 27 and a half. You don't even look that old. Thank you, fam. I'm, I'm 40, and I spent three-fourths of my life incarcerated. So, um, 
you do the math, you know? Daddy's girl said you should dress up. But what? You know what I'm wearing right now? I got my pajamas on. <laughs> I got my pajamas on, my blue Pumas, my, my Linda Vista shirt, my scarf, and I'm chilling. I don't care. I look fly and everything. I'm confident as hell with that too. You feel me? I don't care. I, I, I don't care who, what, when, where, how. You feel me? I am. I could wear whatever the hell I got on and still look bad. You know what I'm saying? Because I got it from my nephew. Don't play with me. <laughs> I could be out here. This morning I woke up. I really thought that, right? I like, bro. You should get dressed up. You out here in Frisco. You know what I'm saying? You get. You should get. You know me, real fly and, and dapper and, and go do your thing, right? And I was like, man, forget that. I'm finna wear my pajamas. I'm finna just, just do me. You know what I'm saying? You like it, love it or leave it. I don't care. You feel me? Who, who? If you could set me now the way that I'm dressed, then oh, oh, girl, when you, when you see me later, ooh, ooh, okay. You feel what I'm saying? It's gonna be a whole nother, a whole nother vibe. You feel me? OMG, go get a costume and wear it. <laughs> That'd be funny as hell. <laughs> Homie Burr said, do it. You should dress up and go trick or treating. Man, what's up? What's going on with my straw? My straw bed on me? Orange Fanta. I love this soda, bro. Okay, you should dress up and go trick or treating down a few streets. No, no one would know how old you are. Thank you, Sierra. Let me read through the chat. I saw how emotional you got in that last walk with your aunt. Broke my heart. You're on the right path. Thank you. Come on, Donnie. Um, going to Vegas dressed up all day, every day here. Um, men said pure thirst. Oh, damn, thank you for the I appreciate you, sassy girl. Pure, pure 39? I think I'll, I'll, I'll do that. Badass, bro, right? He should do something too. All right, fam. Um, can't believe you're still out, right? So my, my, my boy right here, Min, he's in my chat. He's one of my Vietnamese homies out of Dago. To keep it a buck when uh, I was still banging and all that, he was my... He was my enemigo, right? But we knew each other from juvenile halls. We did time with each other in the pen. And uh, my boy knows. He knows, he knows. He knows what I'm about. He knows what I was about. He had that first-hand exposure, first-hand knowledge, right? And he knows that the longest I ever stayed out since I was 10 was four and a half months. But this time, I've been out in December. We'll be going on two years. Only because I changed my life and got away from all the craziness. So he's surprised. He said, can't believe you're still out. Yeah, I'm still out, fam. I'm going to stay out. Sassy girl, thank you for the boo. And um, life is good, fam. You see me living. Who would have thought, man? Right? Who would have thought everything that I'm doing right now? Right? I know you over there tripping right now. Like, damn, look at my boy go. But that's what it is. You know what I mean? Um, I just can't believe you're right around the way and I can't meet you. Why are you so scared of Arizona? <laughs> Thank you for the um, the IC. I ain't scared of Arizona. I ain't scared of nothing. You feel me? If you really put like this, and you really want me out there in Arizona, go ahead and fly me out. Slide in my DMs and fly me out. So who's scared? You feel me? And if you don't, then you must not really want to meet me, right? I've had people fly me out. I had people that really wanted to meet me, they flew me out. So if you want me to hurry up and get to Arizona, you already know what time it is. You feel me? I, I'm just a flight away. It's an internet kind of dating thing. <laughs> Hi, Kelly Chris. It's cool. Now we not hot anymore. <laughs> okay. Um, God is good. God is love. You are love. Thank you, sleeping. Men say, yeah, buddy. You know, that dim sum up there. Hell yeah. I, I, I'll have to give it a, a, a bar, fam. You have something special in you. Man, I am not sitting here trying to figure out why this straw is not cooperating. Come to the Carolinas. I'm going to come through with an amp. <laughs> That's what's up, Donnie. This guy, um, at King Myers. Good looking out with the Roses, fam. Glad you got to see your family. Amazing. Yeah, I got dope-ass family in Stockton. They... they they, they, they're very family orientated, you know what I'm saying? They know how to love on family, and they show me nothing but love for the game. When you're ready, tonight's flight is here. Where the hell you guys at? Nice. 
Sean, where are you guys at? Where? Oh, shit. Hey, I'm gonna end this chat, y'all. Uh, we about to roll out. Thank you guys for all the love and all the gifts. Um, y'all have a blessed night. And if Vanessa pulls up, then I'll go live again. So where are we heading next?